Well, who could forget this scene? Uh, the man running in his underwear at the Phoenix Open. Oh, it was unbelievable. His name, this is back in February, his name is Max Savage. I'm not sure if that's his real name. Max Savage. And now he's up to something completely different. He sure is. And Mac is growing out his luscious locks. But this time, <laughs> it's to raise money for a nonprofit. And Steve Nielsen and photojournalist Brian Kay, they were there today as he got a trim. This is Max Savage's world. We're just living in it. I always loved the 80s and I, I guess like the reckless lifestyle that comes with the 80s and the mullet's like the full embodiment of it. And a Mac, a mullet, has a story to tell. Living fast, having a good time, and no regrets. He has no regrets in his barber, George. It took me about like six barbers before I found George here. He was one of the first dudes to ever walk in here with a mullet like this and be like, I'm gonna continue this mullet energy. And now there's people that come in here all the time asking for mullets because of him. At Electric Haven in Tempe, he wants to look his best, business and party. My signature racing stripes on the right side, and then George always kills it with a cool design on the left side. You remember Mac, you know that absolute lunatic with locks who crashed the Waste Management Phoenix Open, took a swim, and got busted? The mullet is not just a haircut, it is a lifestyle. And he hopes you agree he's got the best mullet around. He was voted top 75 in the USA Mullet Championships and is vying for your vote to move to the top 25. The natural curls, a lot of people do the perms, they'll even curl their hair. My curls in the back of here, all natural, natural wavy, natural curls, I'm very blessed. The contest benefits homes for wounded warriors. Making it bigger than just the mullets. Uh, we're, we're able to help out uh, the veterans. Obviously, it's a, an awesome organization. He knows what it takes to win. Really, that you have that, that mullet energy behind. It's not just the haircut. It's you, you live that haircut lifestyle. Wow. <laughs> they pay us to do this, guys. <laughs> wow. Look at that. That is amazing. What a catatastrophe. Props to Lily for putting this together for us. That is wonderful. Um, yes, I'm kind of liking it, actually. These are some great mullets. Ellen, I think you look just amazing yeah, in the 80s. Yeah, right now. out of an 80s sitcom. And, John, it looks so good that I feel like you might <laughs> no, actually I'm thinking about it. it. I'm thinking about it. Yeah. Yes. You, and, by the way, at home, you can tell us who you think looks the best <laughs> on the Fox 10 Phoenix Instagram page. You can vote for it. John is running away with it <laughs> yes. right now. Yes. This is John's world. That is hilarious. Yeah. Looks you look like great, John. Dead Mac animals is are un... sitting on our head. Mac mm -hmm. is incredible, right. Steve. He's he is quite a the master guy. marketer. Mm -hmm. He is. He's an Instagram influencer. He gets it. He knows what he's doing. And I mean, it's just magic talking yeah. to the guy because <laughs> every word that comes out of his mouth, you're like, oh, this has to be scripted, right? Mm -hmm. No, it's just him. I said he, he should be in the WWE. I mean, yeah. he would be a great yes. character. Absolutely. And now, you know, if he wins yeah. this, he can enter the WWE as the mullet champion. Yeah. Is yeah. he banished from the from the Phoenix Open, or could he maybe figure out a way to sneak in there again? And what would be the repercussions yeah, of that? Absolutely. I think that he is going to try to find a way to get in. I think that so, That would too. be my guess. Um, you know, certainly we don't condone anyone doing anything <laughs> like that. I want we to be clear this. about that. Yep. Yes. But I would be surprised if that's the last we hear of Max Savage. Um, and I don't, I don't think it's his birth name either, but I don't care what his real name is. That's too good. He is going to win that competition. That's right. We have a link to vote um, for that and to raise money yeah. for the Wounded Warriors, And his barber's too. incredible, too. Uh, it's at fox10phoenix.com. Yeah. Oh, George, the George barber? Is George is great. Yeah. yeah. Unbelievable. Well, props are in playing along with, you know, the... That and was... And BK did a... Brian K did an awesome job. Amazing job, job on that. We had a lot of fun today.